All right, what's up, guys? It's Justin, aka Little Too Cold. Today, I'll be showing you guys how to put expansion packs on Nexus. First things first, the problem that most people have with Nexus expansions is they have too many instances of Nexus content on their computer. To fix this problem, all you have to do go up here, go to your computer, computer, search Nexus content. Make sure you type it in right. It's going to take a little while. I already did it. After it loads up, you're going to see something like this. I only have one folder because I have one instance of Nexus content on my computer. But for you, you may see many folders. If you see many folders, what you need to do, right click on the one you want. In this, in, in this case, you have to know which Nexus content is the one that you want. It should be in Program Files 86, Image Line, FL Studio, 12, Plugins, VST. This should be the correct one. If not, I'm going to put the original Nexus content in a download link in the description. And you can download it and just put it there. But I know this is the right one. So just to be safe, what you're going to want to do is you take the right one and you put it to the desktop or drag it to the desktop. Now, when you do the search results, you might see many folders. After you drag the correct one to the desktop, now you can highlight all of them and delete them. I just dragged it to the desktop, so it's not going to... I'm going to have to skip this. But all right, I deleted everything. Now it should be deleted. Since this is the search results, it's not going to disappear. But after you delete everything and you drag it to the desktop, you're good. Just exit out of it. Now you're going to have to go back to your file explorer. Go to computer, program files 86, image line, FL Studio 12, plugins, VST, and this is where we put our Nexus content folder. So I'm going to get mine and drag it back in here. It was in here originally, but I'm going to drag it back in here. I did all this just to be safe. So now it's back in here everything should be good so now I know for a fact I only have one instance of Nexus content on my computer now for dot NXP files to put them onto Nexus you load up your program so I'm gonna load up FL Studio after FL Studio loads up I go into Nexus to put the expansion on there, you go to system right here, import data, and now you can find your expansion pack and you can just put it on there. This works for .nxp, .nsk, .key.zip. So you just find it and put it on there. Now, if you have a .fxp, this is a little bit trickier, but not as hard. Close out of that. Uh, I'm going to go into my little two cold pack. And I have two folders with .fxps in there. What you're going to want to do is go to your computer. And we're going into the uh, we're going into the Nexus content folder again. Which is right here. And then after you get into the Nexus content folder, you go into presets. Also, I'm going to put in the description these two packs that I found, and they have a lot of good sounds, so you guys should check them out. One thing that you should be wary of is not all these sounds work, and I can't help that. I found these on the internet, so just keep that in mind. Not all of these sounds work. So now that I have my folder in there, I go back to FL Studio. Same thing, open up Nexus. And you see all my packs in here. And you know, the Busy Works Beats one is right here. So now you guys know how to put .nxp and .fxp files into Nexus. Um, if you think that I need to do a tutorial on anything else, clarify stuff more, 
what I need to do to improve on my uh, tutorial skills, leave a comment below. Anything else you guys need, just leave it in the comments. And I'm going to put the download links in the description. I'll see you guys later. If you thought this video was helpful, please share it with somebody else that might find it helpful. And also check out my other page, Just a Little Too Cold, for funny videos. Thank you, like, and subscribe.